anemia. Anemia is when your body doesn't have enough red blood cells to carry oxygen to your tissues. This can make you feel really tired and weak. Imagine trying to run a marathon without enough fuel. That's how your body feels. You might also notice that your skin looks pale, you get dizzy easily, or you feel short of breath even when you're not doing much. Anemia can be caused by a lack of iron in your diet, chronic diseases, or even genetic conditions. Eating foods rich in iron, like spinach, beans, and red meat, can help. Sometimes, though, you might need iron supplements or other treatments. It's important to see a doctor if you think you might have anemia because they can help figure out the best way to treat it. Polycythemia vera Polycythemia vera is a rare blood disorder where your body makes too many red blood cells, which can thicken your blood and slow its flow. This can lead to blood clots and strokes. Symptoms might include headaches, dizziness, and a red or flushed face. It's important to manage polycythemia vera because it can lead to serious complications if not treated properly. Thrombosis. Thrombosis happens when blood clots form in your blood vessels, which can be dangerous if they block blood flow to important parts of your body like your heart or brain. This can lead to strokes. Symptoms depend on where the clot is, but can include pain, swelling, and redness. For example, a clot in your leg might cause your leg to swell and hurt. It's important to get treatment quickly because blood clots can be life-threatening if they block blood flow to vital organs. Sickle cell disease. Sickle cell disease is a genetic disorder where red blood cells become misshapen, like a sickle. These sickle-shaped cells can block blood flow, causing pain and other serious health problems. People with sickle cell disease might have episodes of pain, called sickle cell crises, as well as an increased risk of infections and other complications. It's a lifelong condition, but with proper care, people with sickle cell disease can lead active lives. Leukemia Leukemia is a type of cancer that affects your blood and bone marrow. It causes your body to produce a lot of abnormal white blood cells that don't work properly. These cells can crowd out the healthy blood cells, leading to problems like frequent infections, tiredness, and easy bruising. There are different types of leukemia, and the treatment depends on the type and how advanced it is. Aplastic anemia Aplastic anemia is a rare but serious condition where your bone marrow doesn't make enough new blood cells. This can leave you feeling very tired and more prone to infections and bleeding. It's like your body's factory for making blood cells has shut down. The cause can be unknown, but sometimes it's linked to exposure to certain chemicals, medications, or infections. It's important to get treatment because aplastic anemia can be life-threatening if not managed properly. Hemophilia. Hemophilia is a rare condition where your blood doesn't clot the way it should. Normally, when you get a cut, your blood forms a clot to stop the bleeding. But if you have hemophilia, you don't have enough of certain proteins needed for clotting, so you can bleed for a long time after an injury. People with hemophilia need to be very careful to avoid injuries. They might need regular treatments to replace the missing clotting factors. These treatments can help prevent serious bleeding episodes and allow people with hemophilia to live more normal lives. Lymphoma Lymphoma is a type of blood cancer that begins in the lymphatic system, which is part of the body's germ-fighting network. Imagine this. It's a regular day, and you notice a painless swelling in your neck, armpit, or groin. You brush it off, thinking it's just a minor infection. But over the next few weeks, you start experiencing persistent fatigue, night sweats, and unexplained weight loss. These are the telltale signs of lymphoma. Without treatment, lymphoma can be deadly. The abnormal lymphocytes crowd out healthy cells, impairing your immune system, and making you vulnerable to infections. In the past, a diagnosis of lymphoma was often a death sentence. Today, with early detection and modern treatments, many patients go into remission and live long, healthy lives. However, this path is far from simple. Thalassemia. Thalassemia is an inherited blood disorder that affects how your body makes hemoglobin, the protein in red blood cells that carries oxygen. If you have thalassemia, your body makes less hemoglobin than normal, which can lead to anemia. This means you might feel tired and weak and you might have other symptoms like pale skin, slow growth, and dark urine. Thalassemia can range from mild to severe, and people with severe thalassemia might need regular blood transfusions to manage their symptoms.